Hello everyone, welcome to Periscope. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can trigger events from WhatsApp to an app of your choice using Periscope and Zapier. On your Periscope console, go to Settings. Under Integrations, click on Zapier. Here you will find all your active and inactive keys that connect Periscope to Zapier. Create a new API key. Give it a name. Click on Generate. A new key will be generated for you. Reveal the key and copy it to your clipboard. Note that once revealed, the key cannot be revealed again. So make sure to store it in a secure location. Now let's head over to Zapier and create an account or login to an existing account. Once you have logged in, head over to create and click on zaps. For this example, let's create a simple zap that sends an email via Gmail every time a ticket is created on Periscope. Click on the trigger and from the modal, search for Periscope. Under trigger events, select the event that should trigger your zap. Periscope gives you a list of different events that you can use as triggers. Here, we'll use the new ticket event to trigger a zap that sends an email to our coworker. Test your trigger to see if it's working. Now let's configure our action. Choose Gmail from the list. And from action event, choose the action that you want to perform when the trigger is triggered. In this case, we will choose the send email event. Input the recipient's email In the From drop-down, choose your own email. Fill out other necessary fields as you see fit. Give a subject to the email. Now let's configure our email subject and body to hold details of the tickets. You can click on the plus icon on the right to add dynamic fields to your email body. Periscope gives you all the important data from your trigger event to be included in your action body. After configuring your email body, click on continue, review the email and click on test step. You will receive a test email which you can use to check if the email body is being configured properly. If you're happy with the result, click on publish. Congratulations, your zap is now published. Head on to Periscope and create a new ticket to test the zap. Head over to Gmail to see if the zap is working. Here you can see we have successfully sent a new email with all the ticket details created from Periscope via Zapier. And that's it. I hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.